It's a little earlier start to the school year for the state's largest school district, but for the first time in a long time, Detroit schools will start the year fully staffed. Teachers reported today students start on Monday. That's right, and for the first time in two years, COVID-19 will not take up all the preparations and planning. Mara McDonald is live at Cass Tech High School tonight. Mara, the superintendent says staffing is at an optimal level. Kimberly, that's right, and he says it's really part of, or for two reasons. One, part of a five-year plan. Number two, thank those COVID federal dollars. Let me show you. It was, it was pretty rough. It sure was. Districts and parents navigating the pandemic amid closures and changing protocols. This year, it's a return to normalcy. We're very excited about going in this year and that we're not going to be managing COVID like we have the past two years. VD says the district can get back to working on student achievement, not just treading water. And to that end, DPSCD goes into this school year fully staffed, according to the district. This has been a, a five year process and that started with increasing teacher salaries. Across the board, add in a competitive benefits package and the highest starting salary for teachers in the metro and couple that with some strategic hiring decisions. Last year with COVID relief funding, that was the extra federal money we received, we hired about 170 extra teachers last year. And we did that because we knew 50% of our teaching staff can retire at any time in the next three years. So the district built up a bench. Definitely that does help a lot to know that the schools are fully staffed, you know, because without teachers, how, how can you educate the children? Back here live, what else is new this school year? The district is opting to start school before Labor Day. Teachers went back today. Students start next Monday. Dr. Vitti says, really, this is a twofer. Number one, he says, in his words, it sort of extends the runway to onboard these students, get everybody where they need to be prior to count day. And number two, it will allow them to end the school year in early June versus the end of June. We're live at Cast Tech tonight. I'm Mara McDonald, Local 4. Which is nice to get out earlier in the summer. Okay, Mara, thank you.